G'day YouTubers and fellow 3D printers. Um, I got some interesting filament from my wife for Christmas and I thought I'd just share it. It is from, uh, let me see if I can get this through here, X3D and it's called Silky, uh, supposedly red. So a couple of thoughts. This program, or this filament, uh, it's supposedly a uh, polymer composite of PLA. And it's got a higher strength, supposedly. It's uh, compared to regular PA, P PLA. It's not as brittle. It's biodegradable, low shrinkage, good rigidity. And then the other one is it promises a very glossy silk satin appearance. Um, so I've printed out three owls. One out of normal PLA. And this is um, E-Sun red filament. Printed out at 205 um, on my Wanhao i3. Uh, I also printed out some an ABS one and then smoothed it. And you can see I really baked it um, with acetone. So much so that I lost a lot of the um, finer details on the models. And then the silky filament from X3D. As you can see, if we go back to the regular PLA versus the Silky, it definitely delivers on the Silky appearance. Uh, you have to print it slower. Uh, it's also got a much higher printing range temperature. Um, so 190 to 230. Um, I printed this at 215. Um, and I printed it at uh, 30 millimeters a second as opposed to the standard 60 that I print at. Um, visually, it looks much smoother. It's a lot shinier, as you can see. Um, and the best way to describe it is the Christmas ball balls that you might have had as a kid with the fine satin that used to go around on the outside. That's what it looks like. Um, you can see if it will focus. The detail is actually really quite good. Um, there's obviously layer lines, but they're minor. They're all printed at point uh, or a hundred microns, just for a fair comparison. But it's definitely an interesting material. Um, it doesn't. It's not like a uh, like a 3D printing nerd's recent video on the um, poly smooth. It's not that kind of effect. You've still got the hard edges, but it definitely, at least visually, looks smoother. The interesting thing is, with the plastic from the e -Sun, the PLA, if you close your eyes and run your fingers across it, it does feel a little bit silkier, but if you go this way, the layer lines feel very similar. But that way you can just feel a difference, but it's quite, it's quite minute. Anyway, definitely worth a shot. The, uh, I wouldn't call it red, I'd call it pink. That's probably my only real objection with the filament, uh, and the fact that you need to print slower. The interesting thing is when it prints out or you force out some of the extrusion material that actually expands um, which is something unusual that I haven't seen before. Outside of that, quite a neat filament.